focus on the beat Where anything's possible if you can dream At Baba Yaga House there's stuff to do Where all of your friends are waiting for you And you can do it, you will see. So come and join the family. All are welcome at Baba Yaga Privet, everyone. It's Polonius Ficklebottom, and I'm here at Baba Yaga House, and we're going to do a special book for you today. This is called The Mitten by Jan Brett. Now, this is based on a Ukrainian folktale, and it's a story about a boy who goes out in the woods and loses his mittens that were made especially for him by his Baba. Now, Baba is kind of an informal way of saying grandma in Russian. Babushka would be the correct way to say it. Well, this is one of my favorite books, and I can't wait to read it. Me too, Fred. So why don't we go ahead and get started with The Mitten by Jan Brett, a Ukrainian folktale. Do svidania. Once, there was a boy named Nicky. He wanted mittens as white as snow. If you drop a white mitten in the snow, it will be hard to find, his grandma told him. But Nicky wanted snow white mittens so much that Baba made them for him. When she finished knitting, Nicky put on the mittens and went out to play. It wasn't long before one mitten fell off. A little mole found it and crawled inside. It was just the right size, so he decided to stay. A rabbit came hopping by. He wiggled in next to the mole. A hedgehog wanted to get warm. The mole and the rabbit made room for him. The owl didn't want to be left out, so the mole, the rabbit, and the hedgehog had to move over. The little mitten was getting crowded. A badger looked out of his house and saw the mitten. He climbed right in. It started to snow. So a fox pushed his way in and made himself right at home. Then a big bear sniffed at the mitten. The animals were packed in tight, but the bear didn't care. He crawled in anyway. The mitten was getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Then a tiny mouse squeezed in and perched herself on the big bear's nose. The mouse whiskers tickled the bear's nose. Ah, ah, the bear sneezed. All the animals flew out of the mitten. Nikki saw his mitten sail up into the air. From the window, Baba watched Nikki catch his mitten. See, Baba, he called to her. I have both my mittens. And Baba smiled. <laughs> 